Hello there friends, let us talk about how to put the bypass cable uh, in place of the neck screws in case you want to temporarily remove the neck screws for whatever scenario, maybe take it to a service center or maybe in case of emergency. So essentially how this is supposed to work is uh, the neck screws will go out of the circuit and the bypass cable will sit in place of the neck screws like this. So that is how it is supposed to connect. So for that uh, proceed by unplugging the LED connector and the OBD connector so that the next screws essentially is looking like this. Okay, uh, So this is the cable going towards the VCU and this cable is coming from the accelerator pedal. So all we need to really do is unplug both of these uh, sides, both of these ends and put the bypass cable in place of the neck screws and connect these two together. So for that press it from here the clip and wiggle it out of the place like this and then the pedal side of connector again there is a, a clip to be pressed and then we can pull it out like so. When you are pulling it out make sure that no pressure comes on the cables. Please grab only the plastic part of the connector and then pull it out. Now all we need to do next is interconnect both of these two so that the pedal signal can directly go to the VCU signal VCU of the car. So that is when the bypass cable comes for our help. Uh, the male end of this the 6 cross 1 end uh, goes uh, to this like so. So uh, there is the next screws logo on the, uh, on the bypass cable connector. So this logo face goes towards the notch face of the female connector. So uh, put it in place like so and then press it and you will hear the click and it will sit down properly. It might take pressure but feel free to put that pressure as long as you are not pulling on the wires or anything like that. Only the plastic part should be used to exert the pressure. Then uh, grab hold of the other end of it, the pedal uh, cable. Now here also it is a polarized connector, you cannot put it in the wrong way and you will notice this notch on the bypass cable. So this notch should go to the clip side of this cable and like so if you can just press them together and you will see that the both of them get connected. So now our car is ready to be driven again without the neck screws and uh, essentially what has happened is the pedal cable has come and the bypass cable has directly bypassed the neck screws and passed on the signal of the pedal to the VCU of the car. So this uh, is all about how to put in the bypass cable. Hope this video was helpful. Please reach out to us if you face any problems. Stay tuned.